I never imagined I would be here. There was no master plan. You know, I really, I just followed my passion for science. I want to make an impact and I want to improve patients with cancer, their treatment and um, their quality of life. My job allows me to do that. It's been fantastic showing people around that have, have only ever seen the centre as a, uh, as a schematic, as a lab plan, as a name. The sort of things we do here haven't been done before and it's just a real privilege to be able to work on cutting edge technologies and at the forefront of science. Cancer is always evolving. It's always trying to find new ways to evade drug treatment. I also need to evolve think constantly, need to think in new ways to try and target cancer. Arguably one can say that CRISPR has revolutionised how we do cancer biology and our ability to, to ask what genes do. And in its simplest form it's just a very, very efficient way to change the genome and in particular to turn genes on or off in a way that we could do before, but, but not as readily, not as easily, and not as accurately. I genuinely believe that there has never been a more exciting time to be in science. And actually there's never been a more exciting time to be working in the Cambridge area. When you think about the sort of technologies and methods that are available to us today, that just simply didn't exist seven, eight, nine years ago. I think that's really liberating for the scientists, working in an environment where we aren't aligned as either AstraZeneca or Cancer Research UK, but, but as the Functional Genomic Centre, it, it gives them the freedom to, to just focus on the science. I am actually not aware of any other place where this kind of um, structure has been tried, you know, where, where you've taken this you know, in, incredible toolkit that we've developed, and we being the field of course, but you know, that the field has developed and you know, created a centre that people could use as a, a stepping stone brushing shoulders in the lab around the coffee machine and the opportunity to spot novel areas that could lead to something really interesting um, is really tangible in a space like this. What I think Cambridge provides is it's this really concentrated pool of cancer scientists all working together really closely. It's an amazing environment and I think allows us to do the best science and also just have a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs>